Ask Reddit by Upper Assumption 7103. What would you do if your boss manager showed up at your house after you called out sick and waited outside the door? I work as an agent in my mother's real estate brokerage, so I would be unsurprised and hope she brought soup. That's sweet. Leave them standing out there and refuse to acknowledge them. Boss or not no one comes to my house uninvited. Right? If I'm not expecting anyone I don't even bother checking who it is. Years ago, my boss did this. I had the flu. High fever, cough, and best of all, a really runny nose. I wiped my nose with my hand, opened the door, and greeted the fucker with a nice, long handshake, making sure to squeeze that sknoz juice into every line and crevice on his palm. I showed up for work two days later. He was out for a week. Did you show up to his house? Make a fake recording of myself sounding sick to play when the doorbell rings and after picking up my best friend and girlfriend, we'd all participate in a parade in downtown Chicago. Abe Froman? The Sausage King of Chicago? Don't answer it. Say I didn't know they were there since I was in bed resting. Release the hounds. Excellent. My boss is a good person. Honestly I'd assume they're dropping off a gift or some food or something. That said I would find it quite odd they didn't text or call first. I probably have a feeling like something absolutely horrible happened and they're in a daze. Fortunately, I nor my husband have ever had a boss who was a bad person. He did have one who was a bad boss once and that was a lot of stress. But even if he was the boss who showed up at our door we would assume good intentions because they genuinely liked each other he just wasn't a good boss. I'd let them wait. Also this is my go to I must be coming down with something dream. I'll have a very realistic dream that all my co-workers have relocated to my home for the day. They're trying to be nice about it but they're all annoyed that I'm still asleep. 10 times out of 10. I'll be sick with the flu by mid-morning. Every time. So when I get that dream today, I just call off. So your body lets you know that you're getting sick by having the dream? My boss showed up at my house after I quit my district manager job the same day. I sent a resignation email at the end of the day and turned in all keys and company property. Apparently he didn't see it and thought something had happened to me. He was worried when I didn't show up to work and none of the employees could reach me. That's actually kind of sweet. I'd open the door and cough in his face and close it again. Yes I am that much of a douche. I'd do the same. Maybe even invite them in and lay back in bed. They could get me some soup or tea. Call HR and report them for harassment, as well as file a police report to document it. If they were concerned for me, they have my emergency contact information and or could ask the local law enforcement to conduct a wellness check. I would have to assume this was malicious. This. Also, if you have called in sick you are alive, so not an emergency, so it's max of malicious harassment. I'm in the Philippines and my boss is in Seattle. First I'd be surprised followed by a terrifying realization that my boss doesn't know my address. IDK whatever the fuck that is on my front door but that is not my boss. That's not your boss that's the succubus from it follows yeesh. Tell it pick a better form. Don't answer. Let them in and thank them for bringing whatever it was that they brought. Because if I call out sick. My next two supervisors, and most of my team are calling or texting to see if I need anything. We do that every time any of us call out. If you call out you've got like a dozen people ready to drop everything to help. Take photos videos of me confronting them. I'd ask them if there was a work related emergency, or if they wanted to verify I was sick. Damning evidence of their bad behavior in case I lost my job. I would invite her in. I assume it's important. Or maybe she's being super sweet and checking up on me. She knows my health isn't the best. 
Be sure to wear my birthday suite. File a complaint with HR. Let them stand outside. There must not be much work to be done if he can waste part of the day like that. Like, they just wait out there? Hanging out? They didn't knock or anything? I wouldn't even know they were there. Be very surprised, because my boss lives about 800 miles away. Also, I'm sick, which means I'm not answering the door, or I'm sick, which means I am not answering the door. Call HR and tell them the bad news. Answer the door and ask them why they drove all the way out to where I live. Answer the ring doorbell and say oh, I'm sorry, I can't come to the door right now. I afraid that in my weakened condition I could take a nasty spill down the stairs and subject myself to further school air work absences. Left double quotation mark. Well since my boss doesn't check up on me, and since if I called out sick, I would be sick, then I answer the door to see why he was there. I worked for someone who did this to a co-worker. He also came by my house for something when I had twisted my ankle. Forget what it was but we talked at the door for a few minutes. My ankle was purple and black and blown up like a balloon so I guess he was satisfied. <laughs>